I am back. We froze again. You know, I think every time you guys get a commercial, which I don't get, that every time you get a commercial, I crash. It appears, or that appears to be part of the problem. You know, I'm going to try to find out this week what's going on, either with Comcast, who is my provider, or with uh, Ustream, or whatever. If we can't get this straightened out, I don't know what to do, quite frankly. I don't want to give it up, but this is just a nightmare for you as well. I mean, we just keep going out. And, and then I'll go through and I'll save the one, but you lose a lot in between, and it's not fair to you to take your time and come here and, and whatever. Uh, you didn't get a commercial? Well, I don't know then. <laughs> well, you don't all get the, a commercial at the same time. Uh, Cindy Lou. Hi, Cindy Lou. Hi, honey. I didn't know you were here. See, you may not have gotten one, but Cindy Lou got one. It depends on, you know, we've got people, uh, will you weigh this album when you are done making it? Mine was very heavy and forgot to weigh it. Well, okay. I, I get how long we'll weigh it on, but I don't have a little scales. Okay, let me go. Let me finish up. So we are ready for the third hand. Oh, we're getting a bunch of hail. Hello. Well, I think. I don't know what we're getting, but something's pounding at my window. I've got the blind closed. I got some new lights that I think are better. But I've not had a lot of problems with my lights. Okay, there are three hinges. Are there any questions? Um, I've done this several times. I have not made a special deal out of it. I might do a YouTube. Uh, I know I did something for uh, Judy. Uh, Judy's not here. She hasn't been here for a while. She's not mad at me. Okay, here we go, and here's the quarter inch in between. It just makes a nice, sturdy uh, deal, in my opinion. I have been, and I think we're going to do that here pretty soon. Uh, next week, we're going to have to finish this, obviously, um, because I don't want to rush it, and I won't want me. Okay, and then you bring this back and fold that back on the quarter inch. I don't know if I tried coming in on, uh, you know, Foxfire, or I use uh, Internet Explorer. They're coming out. They're getting rid of Explorer. They've had a lot of problems with it, obviously. And they're going to replace it the first of the year with a new system, a, a new Internet uh, deal. I forget what it's allegedly going to be called. I talked to them somewhere about this. Best Buy, I think, and he said, yeah, they were. It wouldn't be till the first of the year, which is, you know, almost here. Okay, and I went down, back, and I burnished these real well. So there it is. There are six, ooh, there it is. There are six hinges. Now, we have these two flat. Now, if you have the two-inch or whatever, you'd lay this down. This would spread. You'd cover it, and it, I don't do that. And I think... The integrity is still there. I, I feel I've not had, knock on wood, not had any problems uh, with it. So kind of roll these down and turn it over. Now you're going to put glue or tape, either one, on the wings. I call them wings. And you're going to, they're, they're one inch. I call them wings. You're going to put tape. On the back side, you're going to turn this over and put the tape on the back side of the wings. They're one inch. This is half inch tape. Scrap it, have a do. And you're going to burnish that tape. I'm almost afraid to look up. But, you know, I don't know. This is beginning to be 
Well, not beginning. It is. So you've got tape on the, now here's the hinges on the front. You got tape on the back. Not this right here. Because you're going to tape it again. There's a lot of tape. You're going to pull off the tape backing. Pull off the tape backing like so. And lay this as flat as you can. I know it's hard. And then you're just going to fold that back on the back. You're going to burnish it. you got the other side. Pull off the tape backing. This is the difference in the way I do it and the way Kathy does it. Doesn't make it mine. It just makes it different. So we're going to do the same thing. You're going to lay this down on the back as well. And you've completely covered that up. Now, here is your hinges. Now, you're going to think, oh, my goodness. What did I do here? Well, you didn't do anything. That's the way it's supposed to be. Uh, because this last, these, the first and last hinge is right right on the edge like so like so and it looks like this when it's finished there it is it looks like that there's no now to put it down this is the back now not the hinge these are hinges right here but the back you're going to cover this as well and this is what you're going to tape down to your spine area right here like so now this spine is wide enough to use, I would think, a half inch for the hinge and maybe three-eighths of an inch for the spacer if you wanted it wider, if you thought you were going to have more embellishments in it. Hi, Eileen. They still should check it. They still should check it. Why? She's got a booster. I do. Hi, Eileen. When should ask her provider to test her. Mo I just had, they were just down here and put in a new booster. My modem's, my modem is not that old. Uh, everything I've got's relatively new, Eileen. Uh, yeah, they did. They just come out here and put a booster in a month ago. And uh, it's really helped on my email and, and, and the speed of my uh, cable. I'm going to call them. I don't disagree with you there, but. Uh, Um, oh no, the dreaded E. What's that? Yeah, I'm going to have them check everything and see what's going on. And I, I'm going to You can't get a hold of, of Ustream. I mean, it's just ridiculous. They don't care. And I can't afford and I'm not going to pay for that so much a month extra whatever. So I'm going to do it. So on the very back, you're going to tape. You're going to put tape down there as well. I don't think I'm the only one having trouble. I know a couple weeks ago, uh, Ellen had some trouble. Uh, but for the this is the third week, though. I, there for a while, I wasn't having trouble. And I think when uh, Ashley did uh, scrap a dab of dues. But I, I think it might be a combination. You know, I've always had good service. And, you know, I use it for my business. I... Uh, send appraisals down all over the United States and beyond and I don't have any trouble with that I don't know who knows I, I feel bad I feel bad for you guys because you know and then I take my time as well but still I, I you know I'm going to start losing people don't leave me well yeah I can too I'm not going to do it right now, but yeah, I can too. Yeah. The booster may be the problem. Well, I don't know. I don't know. It could be. I don't know. I will call and see what we can do. Uh, but I know after we, Ronnie had some tell. we've got our television, our phone, and our internet all in the same deal. And I know uh, Ronnie had some trouble with some of his television uh, stations. The pixels were not right, and on and on and on, and after we had the booster, that seemed to take care of that. Now today, you know, I don't know what's going on. Okay, here we go. Here's our deal. We're going to put this right in the center. Now this is going to, you're going to have, because this is a bigger spine, uh, 
you are going and if if you want to put in a grommet or whatever after you get this laid down for to put in uh I want this in the middle. I want the middle of the up a little bit. And I want it down a little bit. That is not good. I'm thinking I cannot jump and clap my hands. There we go. It's centered as good, and then you take, I just take my finger and run down real well, and then I'll take the point of my, uh, if you don't have one of these Teflon fold, bone folders, they're scrap, they are wonderful. They don't make your paper shiny when you, you can almost erase a mistake when you're scoring. Not quite, but it helps. Okay, there we go. There we go. Now, on putting down your pages, we do not have anything to go over, like so. Because then you can open your book. You're going to take your hinges on one side and one side only, and you want to take them to the, to the right, and you're only going to tape or glue on one side. And you're going to then put down... And you want to do this before, you want to put down your pages before you put down your designer paper. Because that will cover up that back end. Okay. So, before we can embellish, well, you can embellish, but I'm going to put them down. I'm going to put down the papers. Or the, yeah, the pages. And I use uh, the 3 8 inch tape. scrap a dab do carries. Where is it? Here it is. Now I start from the back. I don't know why, but you still want to fold this down because this is my front, this is my back. I'm going to put down one piece, not on both sides, but on the top. Virtually, I call it the top of the hinge, like so. You got one there, but none there. Okay, fold that down, put another one here, like so, I love making books, well I've been making some books, and I bought, I bought and made a Medora, and made some books, but I've been making a couple uh, junk journals, and I think I showed my junk journal uh, last time or time before with the, t the coffee dyed paper. i tell you what I did. <laughs> I think I showed it to you last week. I coffee dyed some paper, a lot of paper, and I, not enough, but I uh, had some left. <laughs> <laughs> so I put it in a spray bottle and in fact I used it on the paper I dyed after it was all dry and whatever and um, sprayed it manually instead of soaking and it made it a little darker and added some interest and whatever so I thought you know I hope that's all right, and I left it down here, whatever. Well, it started to mold. Oh, my God, it's hysterical. I had it kind of sitting in the back, and I wasn't watching or paying any attention to it. Uh, oh, it was funny. Well, I dumped it and washed out my thing. Okay, that's only, now keep in mind, it's only on one side of the flat, and it's on the front side of the flat because the your um, page because this is the front of your page, it's going to open up like so, and you're just going to, the back part here, you're just going to lay it down like this, and glue it down, now, you're going to have this show on the back, but when you cover up your pages, it's going to cover that up, okay, now I am going to miter these corners, I always do, uh, even though we're not slipping this down, I just 
takes out some of that bulk and kind of finishes them off a little, I guess. So I and you do this now for you. You can do it, or you put it down in the book. Quite frankly, love the hand system. I used another one for years. I never had any trouble with it. I'm not saying I did. I really didn't. I used it a lot, but um, I like this better. As I say, it's and I think well the other one too. You could expand it. I'm sure, but. Uh, I had some that did the same thing going how to throw it out. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know, Daisy. Oh, my God, it was hysterical. I thought, well, and I, I don't know. I suppose we've all had coffee mold in a cup somewhere along the way. Oh, it was funny, and it smelled, and I pitched it. It was all right. I pitched it. But I thought I'd just keep that forever and just spray my pages. Well, not so. I'm gonna do some more pages and tags. I I love that look. I and oh my God, little Ashley, God love her little heart. She um uh, uh what was I gonna say? That was so uh she did tons. She hung them out on the line. She did this. She baked them in the oven. I haven't baked them yet. I'm gonna try that. I'm a little leery about baking. Um. Okay, there we go. And I mitered the corners. You don't necessarily, but so we're going to put these down. I start at the back, and you remember you got a flip. You got a flip here. So you got your page, turn it over because you're going to glue it down on this side. I start at the back. I don't know why. I just always have. And when I lay out my pages, now leave this, oh, a hair, just a hair. Because uh, you want it to fold down. I don't always get it. And glue it down. And there you go. There you go. There it is. And see, you can lift this up. You still can get into your deal here. And you've got this here. But this will cover up with our designer paper. So there's one. This is not a hard little album. I think it's darling. I wish I'd have thought of it. I'm not that smart. I, I can do anything. You show me how to do it, and I can do it. I sometimes. I had uh, another one uh, I've been working on, a design. And uh, I, I bought some watercolor paper, some heavy 140-pound uh, paper. Um, see if I don't line that up right on me. Let me see. Uh, No, that's not right. That's too far off. That is too far off. It's hard to get these down sometimes if you don't stand them up, but you really don't want to. They'll they'll come down after they're uh, used and, and serviced. Okay, here's the other one. I'm going to do it this way. Gretchen didn't show it this way, but I'm going to do this. Sorry, Gretchen. <laughs> she commented that, you you know, you need to leave. But they'll, they'll eventually work their way down. I'm not that close. But I have that one too far away. Okay. I love, well, so I was saying, before I so rudely interrupted myself, which I do frequently, Ouch! Found a shop that sells American candy and then has better fingers. Don't care the cost. Oh, Margaret Ann, I sent you some last year, wasn't it, or whatever. I'm, I'm sure you've eaten them all by now. Uh, well, good. Oh, I love better fingers. That's one of my husband's favorites. He had to go out the other night and make a candy run. I, I went out the other day where to go. I don't know. And they had, um, we like shelled peanuts in the shell, salted. And he, might, oh, well, this is not working. This one is tough. The last one is tough because it's, there we go. Okay, they're all, now, there we go. Boy, I'm off center, big time. 
Oh dear, look at that. Oh, I can't get that off. I don't think. That is way off. I don't like that. Oh, I don't want to tear this up, but I, that's way too far off. Dear word. I'm trying to get this off. I don't like that. That is too far off. That's not right. Tore the paper a little, but I can cover it up, I think. Well, I wish I could get through this without either having to do this type of thing or crashing. Huh? Oh, I tore my paper. No, I didn't. It sounds like it, but I'm not. It's coming off. I tore it a little bit, but I can cover that up. Oh, I did tear it there a little bit. It's okay. Darn it. I thought I had that lined up pretty well. Unbelievable. Be careful doing this because that thing is sharp as well. Okay, I got it. Ooh, well, I kind of got it. All right, I can fix it. That was too far off, just too far off. Toward a little bit at the top, that'll be okay. It's, uh oh, well, yeah, that's not going to show either. Oh! Okay, dear word. I want to take a little smoke because it's not going to show. I cannot believe I was that far off. Tearing this off, I'm doing it over. That was too far off. It'll be all right. It will be okay. You will never know it. Well, you know it, but you can't tell anybody. This is just between us. But I can't stand That was awful. See, you really, I mean, you can make your spine any width. I just made it the same width that uh, she made it. Um, which I like wide spines. I just really do. Uh, and especially on the smaller books for some reason. They look real hunky and, you know, and you don't have to fill them up to the brim either. I mean, but I just think on the outside, I just think they look prettier. Well, let's try this again. Now i got to make sure. i got to have a drink of tea. I've got to make sure. Lips are sealed. <laughs> okay, Renee. Oh. I tend to put the pockets on the hinge and then stick. Oh, okay. I, yeah, I see. Okay, Martin. Yeah. Well, yeah, I don't. Uh, they will have the Halloween candies out soon. Yes, they will. Well, they do. Here. They got the Christmas trees up, for God's sakes. I, you know, I went, I went in Michael's every day. No, I went in Michael's a good while ago. And here they are, working on the aisles and working on this and putting up Christmas bulbs and what. And I said, I mean, it was, I think, I think it was right at the 4th of July. I think. Of course, a lot of people start early. I don't. I never have. But I want to tell you, I think that's a little soon. And I, I, it's too commercial. It just, it just is. I'm sorry. Uh, back to this, Margaret Ann. Yeah, um. Uh, but that's okay. Now I gotta see to get this centered. I thought I had it. Okay, let me see here. This is uh, 
an inch and a half, and this is two. I don't know. I can't do the math. Let me I do this. I get it where I want. Now see that looks even on both sides. It really, really is too high. I'll tell you that. Uh oh, no, 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 not yet. Well, I can't either get it centered or whatever. Well, I want to put it down. It's better. It's better, but it's, I don't know. I don't know. Now, if you're going to put in a grommet or whatever, you should have maybe done that before you put the page on. I, uh, I don't do that a lot. Well, I think it's better. It's still not perfect, but it's a lot better through there. You got plenty of room for embellishments, and you got plenty of room to make those that uh, space in between bigger. I totally agree, Renee. There's early, and there's way too. Yeah. Uh, yeah, is this the way you do it? You put these on and then put it down? Yeah, you can certainly do that. Yeah, I, you know, and I know people start early. I know they do. I, it's, it's, I have always been a late shopper back in the day when I had a ton of stuff to do. I have left on the 23rd and the 24th and done all of my shopping, and I had a ton of it back then. Now, I don't have that much now, uh, other than for the babies. They're very special, of course, and, but, uh, and I send cards. I just find that a little. And there are people that go to the uh, after Christmas sales and uh, they're ready for next year. I don't know. That takes the fun out of it. I used to love to go late and in the snow and on and on and carry packages till I was, my hands were bleeding and run to the car and run back and on. A, and I got it done. I got it done every year. And that's when I had my office. And uh, I would take everything up to my office and, and wrap everything and on and on and on. Um, so, you know. Okay, here we are. And it's 20. Okay, we're going to quit at 3. Uh, I do have something I need to do. Uh, it's okay if I do it. Well, I do kind of need to. But there is the book and there are the pages. Now, here you flip. Here's a pocket. Here's a pocket. You turn it over. And then we're going to decorate these. I'm going to decorate these on one side with pattern paper and the back side uh, with just, I don't know, black or colored paper of some kind. I don't, and probably the inside as well. Uh, and these are going to, I'm going to do the edges. I'm going to, you know, and these fit down in like so. Well, come on, you better. What'd I do? What's wrong with you? I didn't do that down. What's wrong with you? You're to fit in here very nicely. What I do? There we go. So that's your card that comes in your envelope pack. Now remember, you need two envelopes for one page and then one card. So I only use six cards or however many pages you make. I always make six. So those are going to all... And then here you're going to, so you, we are going to start covering. Now, I'm going to double mat these as well. Uh, it makes the paper, and Gretchen did on hers as well, but I do as well. It makes the pages a little stronger. These, this paper is not real heavy. As a retailer, to get the products in, you have to start in June and July. But as a person, I don't do Christmas until the day after Thanksgiving. I'm with you, Carol, and I do understand. I, you know, uh, I'm heading out. Bye, MetLife.
Oh, you're welcome, honey. Watch the recording. It'll be on. Um, anyway, uh, I, I don't know. Probably if I were a retailer, you're absolutely right. I, anyway, back to this. So you're, we're going to start cutting the papers uh, for our, um, uh, now you can go in here and make round, round thumb pulls. Uh, I like the new way I've been doing it on the uh, other, but you could make thumb pulls. But I don't think I, I don't think I'm going to. Anyway, so we're going to start cutting. Uh, you're going to need a C. You're going to need twelve pieces that are four and seven eighths. by, I'm going to leave a little around the edge, about three and four and seven eighths by three, oh well let me see, that might be too tight, yeah, four and seven eighths by three and three eighths, yeah. And you are going to need, let's see, that you're going to need it for here. This flips up. You're going to need the same thing here. I want to measure this one. Four and seven eighths by three and three eighths. Yeah, okay. So you're going to need 12. 12 pieces that measure uh, four and seven eighths by three and three eighths. You are going to need. 12 pieces that measure 4 and 7 eighths by 4 and 7 eighths because this is square. Yeah. Boy, 7 eighths is pretty close. I'm going to make these uh, 4 and 3 quarters by 4 and 3 quarters. You're going to need 12 of these as well. These are on your flaps on the back. Four and three quarters. You're going to need 12 of those. This is on this back flap here, and you've got two sides that's the same size. And you want to cover up that right there. Now, the inside that we're going to cover up, and it's going to go all the way in because you, you cut this opening, is going to be... Uh, four and seven eighths, I hope, by, and you just need to come back down in about two and a quarter. So, uh, four and seven eighths by two and a, oh, or four and three quarters. Let me see. We might do it four and three quarters. Let's do it four and three quarters like the other one. Four and three quarters by two. Because, see, this is just going to slip down. Now, this is four. Oh, let me see. By two and a quarter. Yeah, that'll be down there in that. And you're going to need uh, 12 of these. And these double because you got two cards. Okay, I think that's it. Now, I am going to use black cardstock. Oh, thank you, Carol. Uh, bye, Margaret Ann. Or bye, Teresa. Oh, Margaret Ann. Bye, Teresa. Bye, honey. Um, I'm gonna I'm going to mat them all with black cardstock, and then I'm going to go back and put pattern paper on all of them. Okay. Uh, now on your cards. You're going to need uh, the same thing. Oh, this is four and a half or four and three quarters. Uh, I'm going to do the front and the back, and I'm going to leave the inside this way. I'm just going to cover the front and the back with black cardstock, and then I'm going to cover the front. Oh, I may cover it. I don't know. Cover the front with pattern paper. So it's. Um, 
You're going to leave at least 12 at 4 and 3 quarters by 4 and 3 quarters. Uh, now, this is just the cardstock. Not the, excuse me, not the pattern paper. We're going to do that later. Um, okay, and I'm going to do the edges on this. Uh, I'm going to do one to see where I'm at on these measurements. And there again, these cards, or these, uh, not cards, sorry. Where's my black cardstock? I thought I brought a whole thing I did too. Uh, these um, envelopes are not true square. They're not, you know, whatever. Uh, you need to measure your own. Measure twice, cut once. I did that the other day, and oh my. It slipped on me, and I really screwed up. I'm going to cut one here and see how... I mean, I don't want to cut that many and it not be right. Uh, 12 by 12 paper would be better, but I, don't have, I do have it burnt more there. Uh, it really would. Four and three quarters is nine. So I'm going to waste a lot. 